Neighborhood Health Watch is sponsored by the doctors of HCA Virginia. The holiday season is just around the corner, and that means family, food, and libations at every single turn. But if you're watching your weight, it goes beyond what's on your plate. Today, we're talking about the calories in those tasty holiday drinks, and Mandy Mirzai, a dietitian with HCI Virginia, is here with us. HCA Virginia is here with us. You know, the holidays are really a tough time if you're on a diet. What are some of those rich calorie drinks that we need to look out for? There are so many out there. We have our favorite lattes and uh, things that have lots of chock full of whips and creams and whole milk things. We have our eggnogs that come on the shelf. Yes. We have our apple ciders and juice mixes and punch mixes and tons of holiday beverages, but that also come packed with of holiday calories. And you really don't have to consume a lot of these rich in calorie right. drinks in order to crash your diet. Exactly. Show us. Exactly. So I just brought what four, well, four ounces here in the red and eight ounces here in the purple would look like. Mm -hmm. um, I think what is really interesting to me is when I look at maybe eight ounces of eggnog, about 400 calories right there. But this right here. This right here, 400 calories if we're looking at eight ounces of eggnog. So, and then maybe our favorite mixed spirit, our favorite mixed adult beverage, four ounces of one of those warm, creamy adult beverages could cost us 300 calories. Wow, and that's equivalent to what in terms of solid food? So, when we're looking at that, you know, a donut is about two, 250. Mm -hmm. So, we just ate a little more, we drank a little more than a donut. Uh, <laughs> Don't and, take uh, that extra glass know, of wine I at know, dinner exactly, time. Exactly, exactly. So, no, a great way to cut back. We have uh, some things, you know, lower calorie options, sugar free options that are out there. Mm -hmm. Um, and, and looking at our friend water as well. All right, and when you talk about uh, watching your weight and that mm -hmm. type thing, if you do go overboard and that diet right. is out the window, how right. can you get back on track? A lot of great ways to get back on track. You want to look at maybe journaling your intake, paying attention. There's a lot of great free apps available now just on our smartphones mm -hmm. that'll help us track our intake and manage our intake and our weight. As well as, of course, we can always kick it up a notch uh, with our activity, walking a little bit further, a little bit faster, walk in the path things like that to help us cut right. back. Right, and I guess the best advice is kind of push away too. Yes, it is always <laughs> nice to say control. no. I always say, you know what, try to find other aspects to enjoy. Enjoy the friendship, the fellowship, right. the holidays, right. and maybe pass up on especially the liquid calories. Well, you make it all sound so very easy. I wish it were. <laughs> Thanks a lot. We Thank appreciate you, so you coming. Yes.